usually want to shave people for their puns, but that was a day one Smash 4 joke. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta get with as, the times. As this is a Smash 4 match, I guess. Like, these two have played each other, like, probably, like, many times before. Jewel and Zamba, no slots, just the, the Xeno game here. Both expected to, to play some top three here at Loses Finals. It just... It, Jewel does a really good job of making sure, like, making Robin look not, like, slow or stuck in place, as most people would say this character really is. Yeah, he's so tricky with uh, with his movement. He knows how to be able to make the most out of big releases and wave bounces and dropping tomes. He keeps himself safe, and his movement is also really efficient. Zomba not actually committing to the down as I feel he would, um, but things that you have to respect Lazy as, uh, as Robin, because it can just get past Arcfire. Good lead here from Zamba. Simply holding Gyro in hand to set up from the ledge. That's a good get up uh, attack there. It's just, I think it's just low enough to uh, get through with things here from Jewel. And Jewel's been using it a lot this whole tournament. He's been getting away with it too. It's pretty sick. Ooh, Jewel Ooh. trying to catch that jump, but it's really difficult to challenge Gob's recovery because he goes so high. He has so much abil availability to mix. Oh, oh. it's a bad spot. No sword. And no win, I think. Is this gonna be it? No. The Zom I, I really thought Zamba would go for like the down through and have kind of a position. That was good. The tech though. Zamba side beat we the off long line. way. <laughs> we offline. That's how you can tell. We <laughs> offline, but also Zamba should have uh, side beat to the right uh, side because it'll that always send cool. in that direction. Yeah. Uh, the one that Rob is facing initially, so a little bit difficult. Oh, good, good recognition from Zamba to to roll away there. Mm -hmm. I thought that was like a plus situation for Jewel for to confirm something out of that shield. But it's good blocks there from Zamba. Gets the stock off with the throw. Ooh, catching that. Sniped. Yeah. Sometimes when you get like a little bit too lost in the idea of, hey, I want to throw out a projectile when I'm off stage to keep myself safe. You see this with Rob and Jago. You see this with Yoshi and Egg as well. Sometimes you get too comfortable doing that. You're not paying oh. attention to the hitbox right in front of you. Oh. Zamba, not going to be able to find that spike, but. Mean enough to cover that neutral get up. Oh, oh that Rob back air. Good stuff there from Zomb, but it's so rough to come back from this. You gotta turn up now. Turn it up. Darwin was left speechless after that. I'm sorry, y'all. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just <laughs> looking at this game and I'm thinking. Uh, what could you do? <laughs> it's wrong. Because Zomba's just honestly holding forward, catching a lot of Jewel's jumps, catching a lot of his ledge options as well. He really understands a lot of like, hey, I need to respect this, and oh, I don't need to respect this. That time Zamba getting a little bit maybe too button happy in the corner, they're going to be getting hit by Arkfire. This is good stuff here from Zamba, holding it down. I despise Jewel through this music. I'm actually like so mad. Because, like, there's so much hype Pokemon music out there. There's so much exciting stuff that you can really, you know, you can really battle to. And this is what he picks <laughs> each time. Personally, I think a, a, a nice calming soundtrack just to help you play the game at, at, a, at, a, at a controlled pace would be helpful for Jules. So the song wow. like, kind of pick like Wars is a, is a thing that we can probably argue about later. But that was good stuff from Zamba. That was a good Showing catch. Patience. He jumped, he baited that air dodge, and he was able to get the up smash. Rob. He, honestly, in that kind of a position as well, um, as as Jewel, when you see a Rob jump at you, like that, you know an up air is coming. You know an up air is coming. So, 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 right there, Zamba just establishes such a good 50-50. It's sick. One Dude, up tilt. If, if, if Jewel tried to double jump, if he still had it available to him, he would get caught by up air because of just how big that move is. If he tried to press a button, Rob is plus, so he'd be able to get up air there before. So his only choice is to try to mix with air dodge. And Zamba was ready. Zamba was ready for it. Sit there and waited. You were like above a platform too, so you had nowhere to go. It, it's it's really crazy how much position this character gets off of one move. This character's top three. I don't care what anyone says. <laughs> I don't know about all that. But game number two, so really big adjustments for Jewel just has to be like being really wary of like some of these situations that Zamba is setting up, but he's just not able to play his game um, oh, nearly as much as we've seen him uh, like really just be able to dominate the pace before. We're not seeing that from Jewel right now. Having a rough time keeping Rob off of them. Rob just getting all their anti-airs in. Zamba doing a good job of positioning mm -hmm. with the gyros as well. Making it a very rough for Robin to approach. Making him look stuck. God dang. Zamba a little bit too late on the downer once again. 
with a couple of like robins. Oh, nice. Wow. It's a little aggression there from Jules to get these nice confirms. Bring the percentage, the percentage right back. What a parry! Yeah, what a parry, but not too big of a punish quite yet. Nice. But Jewel tracking and catching that landing appropriately. Not a whole lot that Zamba oh, can do in that position. Roll? Not gonna kill. Good DI there from Jewel. That's no other dodge. This should be it. Uh, yet again, amazing tech. Zama going for that same side B setup you mentioned before as a aim towards the stage again just for Jewel to get that tech. Yeah. They're really banking on Jewel to not tech that. Jewel's gonna do it every time. It's offline. You know Good patience there from Jewel. We need to get up attack with that thunder. Zombo right now just playing so patiently. Oh, okay, has, wow. He had the good idea, but Robin Foyle is just that big sometimes. Oh, this is going to be a kill. Yeah, 160. Farmed enough rage for it to kill, too. Good stuff there from Zombo taking that stock off. Zombo is respecting Arc Foyle in the right oh. distances. He knows when to hold Foyle. That was such a confident dash attack as well, catching Jewel and all of that started up. So now. Jewel just playing under those platforms really patiently, looking for that next opening. Is he going to be able to find it? Then they're to cover that, that missed arc fire as well. Jewel has their options covered. Go for jump off that thunder. Oh, such a nasty oh, place to be in, but going for the dragon that is so smart. He was able to get past uh, Ooh, the no arc tech. fire and still hit Jewel in the process. This is his stock to take right now. Is he going to be able to lock him down? That's Wh not going to kill What? what? That the eye, by the way, godlike. Immaculate. But oh, going a little too fast with the regression there off the off the plus frames off the block. Thunder. Oh, that's. This could be a setup for Zombo to kill. Oh. Goes for the grab release. That was a little bit interesting. <gasps> going to go so deep. Oh, for it. the shots in the. What? Forgot what that move was called. The wind move. Good stuff for the. Is that the supposed kill. to kill? I guess it does now. <laughs> so I know it spikes. Yes. But is it supposed to kill like that? Learning the hard way. <laughs> so that was good stuff there from Jewel getting that kill. Getting this lead here. Punish. Patience. Good. Yes. Look at that get patience. that that damage in for that nose Get your health back. What are you gonna do? Press a button? Make him work harder. Nope. Not hard enough as Zamba is simply just back airs, taking that stock, making it even stocks again. There it is. First that's that's Jago at center stage once again. You see, but Jewel, you know, he understands, hey. I don't need to approach this. I can just stand my ground. I can keep on pressing side B. Yeah. I know that you want to go ahead and try to pick this up and maybe catch one of my jumps, but he kept his feet planted, which is such good counter play uh, to be able to deal with that, at least positioning wise. Yeah, very good stuff there from Jewel. This could be Zama's chance to again right in just to bring the stock to their favor. Oh, the downer! Really? Oh, oh, you were on the stage. You're so blessed. If I'm Jewel, I'd be. I would be thanking every deity in existence. <laughs> I'd like, thank you, God, Allah, the Buddha, name them all, Santa Claus. <laughs> oh, they're on the gyro! Oh, and that's Jewel off stage once again with no early dodge. Tries to go through the setup, ends up getting a stage spike with Jago as Jewel ends up dropping down. This is still anybody's game right now, but Jewel has the stage. Oh, the roll! The chase. <gasps> Very close game! Oh, this trade. He's dashing in and he's dashing out. He's making Zamba so scared right now. Jewel seems so comfortable here. Zamba stalling a little bit. Oh, wow. not enough to stall. Jewel just simply waited for him and just up here. Just swing on. The key to victory. The key to victory. Robin has some big buttons. Huge. Massive. Huge. That up there was able to outrange <laughs> Rob Neutral, which honestly says a lot because that move is, is no hitbox to sleep on either. This is a really good attempt at stalling wow. here from Zombo, but they probably pushed in there a little too early and landed right on the the, the worst thing you can land off in this game, a platform. <laughs> I'm sorry, those platforms are not forgiving, especially in this game. Like death sentences. Thunder. El Thunder, yeah, Jewel is just confidently pressing those from center stage. Zomba is not able to get in on that, but goes through back through a dash attack instead of the typical up throw in that position. Zamba responding to these aggressive forward airs quite well. So they're getting their damage in. It's good coverage with that Nair, too. Some don't work. Nair got, not, Nair got my back. You know what I'm saying? Jo Jewel just keeps on interrupting all of Zamba's approaches with these Thunders and Alpha Thunders. He uses them to tech, cha to tech chase. He uses them to call out a lot of approaches from Zamba as well. He makes it difficult for them to get anything started. And especially with the way that Jewel plants his feet, he doesn't really have to worry about, um, 
you know, he doesn't have to worry about Jago either. They're also doing a really good job of winning these weedy spikes. That upper is going to catch him on the high recovery. Yeah, Joe Robin didn't want to go to lunch. Two best friends. <laughs> Press the stuff here from Zamba. Taking his lead, running away for two. Come chase me. You can't. I'm all the way up here. I got to float. Jewel really wants to catch one of these landings, but Zamba continues to make himself so ambiguous, so difficult to hit. Jewel dashing back and forth, finds Oof. that parry into the jab. One, two, three. And. Landed on the. Is that going to oh. be it? Oof. Wow, they I feel like Zamba's just SDIing off. out of it. Zamba's like SDIing like out and down of it. And as a result, Jewel is just not able to find a lot of follow ups. <laughs> Oh, you know, what a trade there. Jewel getting his positioning, though, but... And the stock right there off that snipe. Good stuff. Yeah, I was able to catch Zamba jumping back in from the ledge. Um, so that's something that he needs to be a little bit more mindful of. Jewel with Jago combos? Maybe not yet, but I do like the attempt. When they get him, though? Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this matchup is going to be looking free for him. Nice combo here off the down throw. Not enough good positioning as Zamba mashes out and just takes positioning back. Zamba has just not been able oh, to Oh, wow. wow. Did they tech off that? That was insane how they came back from there. That, that is interesting counter the play. That is not counter the play that I thought I'd be seeing today. No, it was that counter the play that I know about. But you know what? You can just wait for Jago to hit you, tech that, and then jump. Interesting. I'm amazed at Jules, like presence of play here. It's like they've not, we haven't seen this guy play for like a year now. And look wow. how solid they're playing today. Yeah, but Zamba just keeps on continuously catching these jumps out of the corner from Jewel. He's been able to get a good amount of stocks like this so far. That's a back throw into the dash attack. The roll getting oh covered. The catch in the gyro is really good stuff, but the positioning is still in Zamba's favor. The art. Yes, confirm off that. This could be anyone's game. I, I can't count Jewel out. It's not it's not it's not as close as it's not as like in Zamba's favor as, as most people would think at the moment. But like yeah, no, Jewel is, as a player, he is so confident in a lot of his follow-ups. He can tack on so much damage so quickly, while I feel like Zamba's just really consistent at some of the cleanup, um, especially in some aspects of the game, like tech chasing. So as soon as he's able to set that up for himself, Good that box. game will be his, but <gasps> Jewel is looking Jewel has for to not get caught lacking once here. Good jab. I'm liking the use of the arc fire to cover the mm. platform, though, too. Yeah, it's catching a lot of Zamba's landing and catching a lot of his jumps to the platform as well. So just forcing oh, him no to book. keep him on his toes. No! It's going to be bad. The anti-air. That was a good landing there for Jewel, but Zamba simply just dash attacks him for the positioning. Oh, the snipes. Your days are numbered. <gasps> oh, no! No confirm. Not quite yet. <gasps> this is it. The yes. dash back punish. Zamba wasn't ready for it. Jewel. That was a mix-up. That was quite the mix-up on the timing. I thought that was going to be a grab. I thought it was going to be a dash attack, maybe an up smash or whatever. But to dash in, bait an option from the opponent, and dash back, simply threatening with your own movement and your own positioning. Look at that. Dashes in, dashes back, and baits out that spot dodge. If Zamba kept shielding, he would have been dead. If he rolled, he would have been dead. If he spot dodged, which is what he did, he would have been dead. He might have that had would enough cover time the to jump. Away too. You're right. Yeah. Oh my God. That is dashing in like that insane. to make the opponent scared, and then dashing back out. Jules' brain massive. That was, and and he has nerves of steel to be able to pull that off. And in, in a nail biting game three, last stock, last hit scenario, to be able to try to move that fluidly and mix around the opponent's shield like that. That is confidence. Um, so He's so good. He is so good. I'm so afraid for John right now. You got to fight this guy. <laughs> like, 